in control of this game is Adam Jones' sixth match, the man from Wales. And Los Pumas in the dark of blue shirts, a different alternative strip for them. Easy to distinguish between them and Samoa in the all-white strip as we get underway here in Vancouver for 2017. Nice high start, beautifully taken down in the arms of Samoa by Va. He gets his first hands on the ball and now a look to just hold on to position, take it into the contact through their captain, Iono. Options both left and right. More players down the left-hand side and they didn't pass it there. Their lure. They scored six tries in Vegas last week. Well, I was just going to say, the Argentinians right on top of Lealua, right off the start. He was from the here, here. sole spark, the sole inspiration for Samoa. This is the kick, just hanging, just goes 10 metres, but really well claimed by Va'a. Penalty on the halfway means that they go to the set piece. Samoa, the dummy, then the big wide pass, good width here out to Iona. Didn't get too much game time in Vegas, and he's lost the ball forward, so... Strong defense from the Argentinians. Not, yeah, an uncharacteristic from Iono there. Very experienced. This is his uh, third, 40th World Series stop. Just pops out of the hand. He's trying to get that arm free to keep the offload option available. And as you said, the Argentinians doing well to knock it loose. 65 tries for the Salmon captain. And look at Argentina, the, all the class and all the experience of Gaston Revolt. He is on 650 points. So the short ball, first chance for Argentina with some possession into the contact goes up Mestre. Now they go the same way. They put the accelerator on as well. Good space here. And now Sabato. Sabato beats the first. Some footwork off the left. Can't get away from the tackle of Perez. And now the kick. This is a good option. How's the bounce? It's bouncing up beautifully. Just needs to be controlled here. Has he got the pace? Yes, he has. Argentina opened the account. And great try. Joaquin Riera picks up his first in Vancouver. Well, as great as the kick was, it was Riera who spotted where the space was. Out of your shot there, he's signaling, he's waving his hand, sticking him behind. And he just gets enough of a roll on that to ride this tackle over the line. Good first blood for Argentina. Rieta picks up his first in Vancouver. Beautiful camera work there, catching the moment the ball gets over the line. And he is a very good player, is this young man, just 23 years old. It is the flip side, Willie. If you do put pressure with good line speed, that means there's space in behind. So teams that kick well, and Argentina's traditionally kicked well, can punish you if your sweeper's not in a good position. Gaston Raval just under the bar, didn't miss by much. And there is your try scorer. Sat next to him on the uh, on the flight from Vegas to <laughs> Vancouver on Monday. He'd be happy with that. Nice well, small man like you. Well, he's a softly spoken guy. Speaks good English. And is really enjoying his time on the series. A great finisher. Argentina lead 5-0 as we approach the second half of the first half here. Similar again. It's Va'a gets up and taps it back. And now Samoa come back on the attack through Perez big Joe Perez into the contact they go I don't know the captain I know what a three he is and so they close the space down as quickly as they can a little bit of footwork there from Lea Lua now he's able to free the arms and now just a sweep and a beat they break free and law party won't be stopped good response from Samoa World Party celebrates, but it was Le Louis again creating the opportunity for his teammates. He's on his toes, he attracts the attention of the defenders. There's the big hit that the crowd gives the groan. Right across the front. It isn't dangerous. It's a question. And that was Le Louis doing the damage. And in the end, Ropati just stepped out of the weak Argentinian tackle. Sevilio Ropati. One of the New Zealand-based players for the Maris Club in Counties Manukau. Counties Manukau, a region where John Alomu started his rugby and they won the national competition of New Zealand in sevens and he was a big part of that team, was Ropari, now playing for his country. And they're loving it. Lots of fans here all over North America. They travel. Fijians, obviously incredible supporters of this tournament, but so too the Samoans. 
The lights of Salt Lake City and Seattle are empty today, Willie. They're all up here watching World Series 7's rugby. Another high restart. This is a good contest between these two countries. The 66th Samoa have the edge and some footwork there from Leo Lua. He's really getting involved in the game a lot more, but a turnover and it could be costly here for Samoa. Osochuk wears jersey six. No space there, so gives it back into the pocket where Raval has a beautiful passes. Three passes and the ball almost has gone across from one side of the field to the other. They, there's no space there, so Sosa comes back. Luna gives a short ball and now they get into the backfield. Argentina on the attack again. Wide passes, they should score. Otsochuk started it. He's going to get it done in the corner. Matias Otsochuk, wonderful team try. Every player on the Argentine team touched the ball. It almost went wrong here with Zapato getting into trouble, but he steps out, keeps the ball alive. Great offloading. A pass perhaps a bit forward. But in the end, just a simple show and go. Five tries in Vegas seven days ago. First year on the HSBC Sevens World Series. And as I mentioned in the intro, he is the gold nugget for Los Pumas in 2017. Raval looking to add the extras. Good kick. Are you kidding me? Great kick. Huge kick. A full try. The difference. Canada Sevens is off and running. And Argentina in good shape. That young man there on such a, he's just 19 years old, still a baby. And I've no doubt that the selectors and higher honors are looking at this young man thinking, wow, what a talent. He is, and great patience from the Argentinian team there, keeping the ball alive. The Val goes deep into the 22 of Samoa. Ropati gets it. And they bring it back into the midfield, some footwork, and now the ball out the back to Ayono. Some special play here, but he may have injured himself in the process. He hasn't okay. moved the player on the 22 still, so Samoa will have to do it with six players here as we enter referee's time in the first half. Ball shoots out there. Iono goes in and clears it and gets it out to Va. Va, big and strong, athletic. Raval looked like he can oh, steal oh. it. He's got the penalty. Great work, Gaston Raval. Huge experience, great textbook tackle. And stays on his feet to steal the ball. They're Nestle off and running. gets it. Now we go on the attack. Seven on six. They've got an overlap here, Argentina. They just need to be patient here. Atsotchuk scored the first. Won't score the second. And has given possession away. Half time. I think the referee says it's a free kick. Actually, Very interesting. He did the right thing there. The Simone and called for a free kick, a mark. So uh, he's going to end the half if he wants by kicking the ball off the park. But we do have this injured player back in play. No, we very rarely see that in the sport of sevens and I think that the Argentinians might be telling his teammates that we had an overlap there and a chance to extend our lead. Yeah, he put it to his boot, chipped it ahead, hoping to get the 50-50 ball. But credit the Samoans for getting across and there is the, the hops and ankle injury. Oh, that's a good sign. Oh my. Looks a little tender from here. I think it's the knee or the ankle and he wants to just get some time and so on the field comes some more to Laura in Jersey 10. As always, the sevens, it's never over till it's over. And Samoa's going to have a go here. Former, I think, is the player. And here is Toloa, who's just come on the field. Samoa Toloa, that kick step there from Lea Lua. Big tackle coming in over the top from Mestre. Samoa want to finish the half, trying to level the scores. They trail by seven. Ayono goes into the contact again. Lea Lua, the dummy, gets up. That's another good tackle from Mestre, one of the best. In the Argentinian side, we're in jersey number 10. Ayono says, let's go down Main Street. Nice and close, the turnover, and that's a good one from Sabato. Argentina want to get on with it now, so no one's listening to the referee. We're in his time, and we've played about two minutes of it. Two minutes of extra time on Sochuk. Kicked the first time, scored the second, picks up a double. What a hit on the line. Osochuk backed himself. And because he wasn't held, he got off and got over the line. I think he's feeling that one. Look at this. Very direct. He made his mind up early. He dropped the shoulder. Big tackle. Wasn't held. Reaches and scores. The Argentinian coach Santiago Gomez caught up. He took over from Andres 
Ramanoli, 230 tries, and he just may have unearthed another try scoring machine in Matthias Otsochuk as we look at the conversion from Raval. Can't angle it this time. Half time, and Argentina lead three tries to one. Scoreline of 17 5. Good scenes here early morning. 10.30 a.m. on the west coast of Canada here in Vancouver. To the opposition, 22 for three tries. Samoa, one for one, so they've got 100%, and there's plenty of color and costumes in this magnificent stadium here in Vancouver. Underway in the second half, nice high kick for Roll Party to get up and challenge. Otsochuk gets his hands to the ball and gets taken out. The field of play, Samoa. Have they heard the words of wisdom from Gordon Titchens about being patient, about hunting his three? They need to score next if there to be a real threat in this game. They are, and that man was almost on his own last week, as we mentioned. They've got to put together a team effort here. Ball goes deep, Raw Party goes high. Not straight. Option. And the Welsh Scrum referee says that's not straight. Can't afford that in seventh possession, so critical. Look at that. It's got to be down the middle of those two lines, clearly off kilter. Yeah. Crouch. Oh. Bind. Set. Didn't miss by much. But there the ball is won. Then Raval jersey number nine loops around that captain. Raval now trying to create some space on the outside for Sabato. No space and nothing there. Lovely short ball coming back on the angle, hitting it beautifully was Rieta. They're playing on here. Samoa slow to react but finally they get back and they get possession holding on to the ball here comes argentina again another penalty and the editor says let's get on with it the quick tap raval who started it Otsochuk, who scored two looking for his third uh -oh. here comes the hat trick Otsochuk says perry baker you get three so can i still hasn't cracked a smile and he's got three on the board not much on here, he just shows a bit of a half dummy, one step. Poor Samoan defense over committing. This boy knows how to get it done. For such a young man, he shows a lot of maturity and class to step and go. Made one error where he kicked the ball away. But geez, I'll tell you what, someone that scores 15 points and gives away one penalty, I'll take that every day. The Val good contact in between the posts and look at the stat of this young man first year on the series and there he is sitting in fourth place that's impressive it's a pretty fine company there yeah, he just uh, backs himself with a good team effort just before that phase a set piece move by the argentinians yes you are on tv and yes it's going to be a nice weekend <laughs> Well, for me, Samoa needs some inspiration. They need Samoa to law to get his hands on the board. Or party should be able to claim it from the kickoff, and he does. They move it into the midfield and try and set something there. And now they get over the advantage line and into the backfield. Now it's a foot race, and there is the man that I was saying needed to touch the ball, Samoa Taloa, with a 90-meter sprint to score his 78th try, and it was a beauty. Well, that is the direct attack we're talking about. Just a simple flat ball, spotted a hole in the defense, and the sweeper of all could do nothing about it. Look at that leg lift. Look at that knee drive. Great pace, great finish. He's come off the bench, and he's made a statement to his teammates. Well, hate to say that he's the man for me that needed to get the ball in hand, and just what the doctor ordered. That will put a smile on the face of Gordon Titchens and the big Samoan contingent of fans that are here. At BC Place, the conversion is over. 24 plays, 12, three to play. They go out to the right. This is where Ropati gets so well. The kickoffs are such an important part of sevens, but the ball is tapped back. Good pace shown by Perez to get back and then show some footwork. Perez says, I'm in here. And I want to go to the party. Otsochuk makes the tackle. Didn't roll away quick enough. Ropati gets on the go and now some more oh, patience was the word from Gordon Titchens 
hunt a three so that they don't get the turnover Argentina and they're doing it well in the second half cleared out to the left where they've got some players nice pass out to where to Laura is Samoa to Laura on the sweeper ball on the inside here comes Samoa what a response VAR gets his first here in Vancouver Good skip ball here. They saw that the Argentinians were pressuring. And he has the presence to keep his feet, keep the ball alive. He just had a big run. He still had the gas to get through and then flips it inside. Rafael Ibarra, beautiful support line. Uh, the money ball was just before that where it skipped out two of the Argentinian players out to the wide extreme where Taloa was standing some more. Taloa, this an all-important kick, Gareth. It brings them within five, so a converted try will get them the win. Yeah, it's never over in sevens, a minute 33 to go. The kickoff again, so important. How is the bounce of the ball? Argentina have it, their tackle's high. They'll party around the shoulders on Rojas. And there's no hurry at all from the Argentinians. Los Pumas just walk. Yeah, this one, everything's got to be below the shoulder line. That one just reaches up. Not a great deal of intent there from Ropati shows again the quality and also the importance of the kickoff stats that we receive around 95 percent of teams that win the kickoff score the next try and there is Gaston Rafael Raval underneath the great Santiago Gomez caught up of course Gomez Cora coaching this side he'll be happy but he'll be a bit nervous now well Gomez Cora there scored 230 tries not too many people know that there's a conversion in the tally of points as well didn't do too many conversions as his time, and here comes Los Pumas, the step off from Delgate. To the left they look, Raval decides to give it out to the right, and Rojas in jersey 13 for the Argentinians into the contact goes Bardier. Looked like he was isolated. They finally get there, the short ball is a good one. Now they've got some numbers here, missed tackles from the Samoans. Two on one, out wide they go. Argentina looking to finish stronger. Samoa need to be careful here. There's only brings the make short. Now they've got a full line out out to the left. Raval moves the ball out to Mendes along the chain towards Sotchuk who's picked up three. Kicks it out. And the referee says game is over. And Argentina in a close match in their first game against Samoa. Four tries to three have won the match. The scoreline of 24 to 19.